Hey guys, Andy here. You may have seen me recently review my brother's Bose QC35 II headphones. Uh, well, I was so impressed with them, I got my own. Uh, and then I thought, well, if I'm using them, I'd rather connect to my PC using Bluetooth. So I got this Ugreen USB Bluetooth adapter to give it a go. Now, I'm specifically wanting to use it for playing games uh, like PUBG and Overwatch and such. Uh, so I thought, well, let's just give it a go, see, uh, see what it's like. It was seven pounds on Amazon at the time of doing this video, so not too expensive. You get a driver's disc, but they do say when if you're using Windows 10, you shouldn't need to use it. Um, the instructions pretty much just telling you, you know, it's Bluetooth. You can connect to things. Uh, okay, I think I know that much. Um, so in theory, you plug it directly in, and off you go. It didn't seem to work so well for me, but we'll get to that in a second. I put my headphones in pairing mode. And it should just connect. So the problem I had was it just wasn't registering as being a Bluetooth device. I went through, I mean, I went a long-winded way of going through my registry and removing everything that I could find to do with Bluetooth. Um, but actually, I think the bit that did it was when I went to Control Panel and just uh, I found the Bluetooth device and just uninstalled it. Basically, if you've not done this before, look into your USB devices. Just find the one that's uh, says sort of remove or uninstall or whatever. I hit that. Uh, I think I rebooted and I then plugged it back in again. And then you should see the Bluetooth on off toggle. If you're not seeing that, that's when you've got the problem. That's when you've got to try and remove whatever you had before. Uh, once you see that, you should get the Bluetooth icon down in your system tray as well. And it should be a fairly simple job of just selecting what you want to connect to. The headphones are already in pairing mode and you see it connects nice and simple to the Bose headphones. Obviously, there's different ways of removing that if you needed to. You can see them there in the, the device list as well. So, as I said, my uh, everything seems to be fine. I could play music, that sounded great. I've got the noise cancellation from the Bose. Everything's brilliant. But the problem for me, there is a slight delay. Um, I had been, people had said, oh, you might get a bit of lag. And there was, a, it's in about a third of a second. But when you're playing games, you pull the trigger, and a third of a second later, you hear the bang. It's a little bit off putting. So, I'm probably going to send it back. Um, I'll perhaps try another one. If I find one that works well, I'll do another video and let you guys know. So, for now, my name's Andy. I'll catch you all again soon. Ah, you made it all the way to the end. Well done. So, thanks for watching. Hopefully, you enjoyed it. If you did, please do subscribe by clicking the little fella over on this side of the screen. You might also want to check out the other videos should be just there. Check out my website as well, androidandy.uk, made by me. I'm learning HTML and PHP, so hopefully it's uh, functional. But I'll see you again in the next video.